we should ponder on Uber. Why do I say so? If you look at Barisa National and the Dato Sri Najib, there's a clear direction of growth for the next 10 years. The transformation program to ensure that we achieve 6% growth, high income status by 2020, greater prosperity, and a better quality of life for all. Of course, DAP will continue to rubbish this transformation program. But ladies and gentlemen, let me remind you, after the Facebook IPO, the world's second and the third largest IPO come from Malaysia, which are all oversubscribed. So Malaysia recently was regarded as a bright spot in the global, in a gloomy global financial market. Our share market continues to go up. There is no denying about it. It shows the investors' confidence. And this will reject DAP so-called gloom and doom of the Malaysia economy. If we want to face doom and gloom, it is Pakatan riot with its populist policy. Every day is talking about the same thing, as I've said, long on rhetoric, short on action and delivery.